Hello! Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Mary. This is my dog Murphy, who always has to pop into videos as soon as I start filming. You weren't even in here before. But um, today's video is going to be uh, my entire physically owned TBR. I should have told you that I loved you one more time. So my plan for this video is just to show you all the books that I own that I have not yet read that I plan on reading. Excuse you. I also have some books on my Kindle, so I'm going to read you out the books that I have purchased on my Kindle that I have not read that I plan to read. But without further ado, I'm going to start with my physically owned books. I'm not going to be telling you really what these books are about because some of them I don't honestly know and then that would just make this video really long. There's also not that many books anymore, but the reason I wanted to make this video is because, first of all, other people make this video and it seemed like fun to do, and also to hold myself accountable for reading more of my physically owned books and just books that I already own and not getting so many books from the library, because as much as I love to support my library, and you should too, I do have a tendency, or I have in the past had a tendency to purchase books and then just never read them and they're just sitting in my house. I made a goal for myself this year. I'll link the video where I announced my 2021 reading and life goals, and one of my goals is to read one book at least a month from my physically owned TBR or just to have 12 fewer books on my physically owned TBR at the end of 2021 than I had at the beginning of 2021. I'm also currently on a book buying ban. I'm not sure how long that book buying ban will extend to, but that is my plan for the moment. So without further ado, let's just get into all of the books that I own. A Walk in the Woods by Bill Bryson, A Game of Thrones and a Clash of Kings by George R. R. Martin, Forrest Gump by Winston Groom, Madame Bovary by Gustave Flaubert, I guess is how that's pronounced, Tender is the Flesh by Agostina Basterica, Dante Alighieri, His Life and Works by Paigette Toyn Toynbee, The Quantity Theory of Insanity and Other Stories by Will Self, The Inferno by Dante Alighieri, The Grapes of Wrath by John Steinbeck, Wake Siren by Nina McLaughlin, Call Me By Your Name by Andre Asiman, The Lords of Discipline by Pat Conroy, The Lost Symbol by Dan Brown, The Origin of Species by Charles Darwin, A Court of Thorns and Roses, A Court of Mist and Fury, and A Court of Frost and Starlight by Sarah J. Mass, The Shadow of the Wind by Carlos Ruiz Zafon, Lord Loss, Slaughter, Beck, Blood Beast, Demon Apocalypse, Death's Shadow, Wolf Island, Dark Calling, and Hell's Heroes by Darren Shan. That's it for my physically owned books that I haven't read, so not too bad, honestly. I've seen some people who have like hundreds of books and I just don't really buy books like that anymore. Now I'm gonna go through my Kindle and let you know the titles that I have that I have not yet read. I have not yet read. What, are, what am I trying to say? What are you? An idiot sandwich. Sweet Tooth by Ian McEwen. The Silent Wife by A.S.A. Harrison. The Heretic's Daughter by Kathleen Kent. Me Before You by Jojo Moyes. The Invention of Wings by Sue Monk Kidd, Where'd You Go Bernadette by Maria Sempe, The Silent Sister by Diane Chamberlain, Await Your Reply by Dan Chon, A Spool of Thread by Ann Tyler, Big Little Lies by Leanne Moriarty, The Boston Girl by Anita Diament, Brooklyn by Colm Toymen, In Another Country by David Constantine, The Nightingale by Kristen Hanna, Miller's Valley by Anna Quindlin, A Man Called Ove, or A Man Called Ove? Ove? by Frederick Bachman, Maybe in Another Life by Taylor Jenkins Reid, Today Will Be Different by Maria Semple, The Life We Bury by Alan Eskins, The Rooster Bar by John Grisham, Hillbilly Elegy by J.D. Vance, A Gentleman in Moscow by Amor Towles, Behind Closed Doors by B.A. Paris, The Woman in Cabin 10 by Ruth Ware, The Floating World by C. Morgan Bapst, Before We Were Yours by Lisa Wingate, In Pieces by Sally Field, Pachinko by Min Jin Lee, Sisters 123 by Nancy Starr, The Other Einstein by Marie Benedict, Clock Dance by Ann Tyler, My Lady's Choosing by Kitty Curran, Supermarket by Bobby Hall, The Art of Racing in the Rain by Garth Stein, Bonnie and Clyde Making of a Legend by Karen Bloomsthal, A Woman of No Importance by Sonia Purnell, We Were the Lucky Ones by Georgia Hunter, The Empty Nesters by Carolyn Brown, The Dutch House by Anne Pratchett, Evie Drake Starts Over by Linda Holmes, Where the Crawdad Sings by Delia Owens, The Giver of Stars by Jojo Moyes, The Girl You Left Behind by Jojo Moyes, Dead Wake by Aaron, Eric Larson, The Identicals by Ellen Hildebrand, The Foxhole Court by Nora Sokovic, The Death of Mrs. Westaway by Ruth Ware, Never Caught by Erica Armstrong Dunbar, Fifty in Reverse by Bill Flanagan, Red Joan by Jenny Rooney, the Inheritance of Loss by Kieran Desley, by Kieran Desai, sorry. The Guest List by Lucy Foley, and Point Made by Ross Guberman. That is it. I did not count how many books that is, but it's a lot. A lot more on my Kindle, I think, than owned in real life. 
This is the stack. Goes all the way down there. <laughs> Okay, that is going to be it for today's video. Also, these are my library books that I have out right now, and this is my depression lamp, so yay. Anyways, if you enjoyed today's video, I hope you will give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos from me, um, click the subscribe button so you don't miss out on anything that I post. Anyways, those are all of the books that I physically owned. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you've read any of these books and think I should prioritize them, let me know down below, and I will see you in my next video. Bye! I should have told you that I loved you. Whoa.